After an amazing 2024 indoor track and field season, the outdoor season has officially opened with a bang. From Litsile Toboho throwing down an amazing 200 meters, to new teenage sensations dropping incredible times. However, we just witnessed a new world record, and it took place at this year's Texas Relays. In the 4x200 meters, we witnessed one of the all-time greatest teams ever assembled, and this really was a perfect team effort for this relay. Opening this 4x200 was Dina Asher Smith from Great Britain, who also just so happens to be the 2019 world champion in this event. Putting Dina Asher Smith for the opening leg here was just perfect planning, and she got away from the field extremely fast. However, running the second leg was Rashida Adelike from Ireland, and just look at how effortless she was for the second 200 meter leg. Now keep in mind that the 4x200 is only two laps of your standard track, and it becomes pretty crazy how big the gap is between first and second. After the first lap, Adelike's lead was already pretty massive, and she passed off to Lene Thompson, who was yet again growing the lead. However, running this anchor leg for Team International was none other than one of the greatest NCAA sprinters and this year's indoor 60-meter world champion, Julian Alfred, who actually ran for Texas while she was in college, but now she's a professional athlete representing Puma for St. Lucia. The moment Alfred got this baton, the world record became all the more realistic, and you can see just how much faster she runs than the rest of the field. With a finishing time of 1 minute 27.05 seconds, they actually took the win in this race by more than 4 entire seconds, which again to do over the course of just 2 laps is pretty crazy. However, when reviewing the fastest 4x200 races of all time, this actually places them ahead of any other race to ever go down, as the closest race before this went all the way back to the year 2000 when the United States Blue Team ran a time of 127.46. When taking the average times of every single leg in this 4x2, it comes out to a time of 21.76 seconds, averaged between these four sprinters, which is a super impressive clocking, because getting anywhere near 22 seconds is very difficult, and even though they did have a running start, 200 meters is still a very long distance, so this was a very impressive performance from all four of these athletes. Now, there is a slight catch to this new world record. I personally believe that this should be a world record because this is the fastest time to ever go down. But because not all of these athletes are from the same country, in fact, I'm pretty sure they're all from different countries, it doesn't officially qualify as a world record. On the all-time list of greatest 4x200 meter relay races of all time on the women's side, this will go down as number one. However, the asterisk next to it is all but insignificant, because this was a brilliantly executed race from four very strong sprinters, and I cannot wait to see what each of these athletes do in 2024, especially Julian Alfred, who is certainly known as a better 60 meter runner, but she's also got amazing 100 and 200 meter chops to her name. Thanks for watching, everyone. And as always, until next time.